this is DC Channel Guns. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What up? This is DC Channel Guns. Coming to another gun video. Appreciate you watching. Like, share, and subscribe. I want to appreciate all my subscribers. I want to appreciate all the good information. I appreciate y'all for coming to the video. Appreciate all the support of love. Appreciate everything that y'all do for the 2A community. Now, with that said, the ultimate goal over here is to uphold the Constitution, defend the Second Amendment. That is the prize. No fame or glory over here. So, with that said, someone asked me a question about concealed carry. Now, I know we got a lot of first-time buyers, so, um, you know, you have to, you know, know that, you know, coming into this is a lot of questions and answers. So, um, I've been carrying over 15-plus years. Concealed carry has a huge advantage. Now, one thing you must know that different states have different laws when it comes to concealed carry. And, you know, I have issues with other states that you have um, citizens who have to prove uh, why they have to conceal carry? Why do they need to conceal carry? And some of these states makes it very difficult. And some of these states, you, you know, it's, it's crazy how their laws are preventing citizens from protecting themselves. And so that's why we have to vote and get out in our state, pay uh, close attention to our local um, laws and stuff like that. You know, we have to pay attention. We have to go out and vote for these things because you have other citizens who not thinking of not even paying attention to that and just voting and stuff. And you then you have politicians. And you have your state passing stuff. So we must be aware of that. Now, when it comes to some states that you have to prove to conceal carry, um, you know, it's, it's up to them whether you need to conceal carry or not. Now, some states have reciprocity. Now, speaking for my state um, here in North Carolina, up to my, um, you know, you can get a concealed carry permit. You have to go take a um, farm training course, which is usually one day. I think it's eight hours. I ain't took it in so long. And once you do that, they give you they give you a document and everything to take to your sheriff's department. And it's probably going to take like 90 days at the most, 90 days. But, you know, during this situation, a lot of concealed carry people has been going to concealed carry. Numbers in my state of North Carolina, concealed carry is up over 200 percent. So many people are trying to get the concealed carry permit. Now, with that said, um, doing a lot of the background checks, going to your gun shop in my state. Now, other states could be different. Even if you have your concealed carry um, license, some states you still got to do a background check. They still have different process. So check your state laws. But the, the whole point of this video is that concealed carry has a huge advantage, especially concealed carry permit is what we're talking about. Now, when it comes to concealed carry permit, in my state, I can go in the gun shop, show my concealed carry permit, fill out the form, paperwork and everything. I can get that pretty much done within 15 minutes up to my, and, and that's, you know, to my at least 15 minutes. So, you know, with that said, it's a huge advantage because you don't have to wait in line. You have to wait for the next background check to come and everything. And with the permit, you can get as many guns as you want with the permit um, license holder. You can get as many guns as you want. You don't have to keep going to your sheriff's department, applying online for a permit, which they're going up, cost you a couple, what, $8, $6, And you got to pay for like three, four, five. And most in my state, they last for five years. So uh, to my, the best thing to do is probably get your concealed carry permit and then you can carry concealed uh, to my, you know, the ultimate surprise uh, to my, nobody knows you carrying. There's a lot of people who likes to open carry. That's fine. I have no problem with that. But, you know, I prefer concealed carry because it's discreet and nobody knows what I have. And it's the ultimate, you know, ultimate surprise uh, to my, you have a uh, upper hand on someone trying to hurt you, attack you or whatever the case may be. I think that is the best option. There's nothing wrong with open carry, but, you know, I think conceal has a lot of advantage. And plus with the permit, you know, you can pretty much carry. You know, you got other states that recognize it. Um, my state recognized other states to carry and stuff like that. Um, that's something that you should look into as a first time gun owner uh, and everything. So if you got opportunity to take a class, find, you know, look online in your state, look for concealed carry. And I advise you to go and get that. Even if you have reciprocity in your state, because I had this question one time before. If you have reciprocity, you don't need a license, I still think it's good for you to get your concealed carry permit in that state if they offer it because you don't have to worry about background checks and stuff like that. Dealing with that, we have millions and millions of background checks, a lot of delays, people waiting, and then you got waiting periods and stuff like that in some states. So you have a lot to deal with. The more simple it is, the better it is for you as a gun owner. So like I said, um, I advise you to get your concealed carry because I love it. I like it. You will enjoy it and stuff like that. And, you know, hey, you can express your Second Amendment all in one. So did just a little video to talk about um, when it comes to your CCW and everything in your state. But check your state 
and get more information so you can be concealed carrying. And whether you have reciprocity or not, I think the advantage of concealed carry permit is you can go in the gun shop in my state, in North Carolina, not do a background check, not be delayed, not, you know, all this kind of stuff. Then you got states who have their system on top of the, uh, the, uh, the, um, the ATF, uh, the FBI background check system. Or to my, they have another secondary system. So, like I said before, get your concealed carry permit, people, and you, um, you'll, you'll be um, glad that you did. So, this is DC Channel Guns, and I'll catch you on the next one. This is DC Channel Guns. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.